It's, it's a moral decision for us. We don't want to take our trauma and have it move to another community. Executive Director of the Jefferson School African American Heritage Center says a new chapter will begin right after the new year. Andrea Douglas says there's a future for the statue, just in a different form. We are going to transform our trauma into something creative, something beautiful, and something important um, that is highly representative of the ideals of Charlottesville. Douglas is calling on the community for ideas. It is the community that's going to then decide what that object will look like and whatever form it takes. We're, we're not describing or prescribing anything in this. We're just facilitating. Local activist Jelaine Schmidt says their intent isn't to erase history. History and memory are two different things. First off, you know what I mean? We're not forgetting history. What we're doing is reframing it. We're not trying to erase history. That's impossible. Um, but history is not made in the past. History is made in the f now for the future. However, this plan will not come cheap. What we are projecting for the overall pro cost of the project is $1.1 million from start to finish. Douglas says they've already raised $590,000 from donors such as Virginia Humanities, Open Source and others.